because I buy a lot of shit. It's probably why I'm broke. run to the mall today but I didn't take you guys with me I'm sorry I'm sorry I did want to show you guys however what I did buy I'm not gonna try anything on because I actually want to create some looks with these outfits so those will be in some other videos to come so we're just gonna go ahead and show you what I got to start off I went to you know your favorites or my favorite anyway H&M so still the same thing as last time a lot of neutral colors but of course a lot of stores are switching over into fall so of course you know you got to get jacket ready so i saw this cute bomber jacket in the window and i couldn't resist this is a size extra large it goes up to a double xl but the extra large like fit me perfectly i love this jacket um i kind of have an idea of what i want to pair with it I'm thinking of finding some dunks, this green color in black, or green color in navy, and then I want to do some like pleather pants with it, and like a cool, cute little crop top. So that's the vision. We'll see if I can bring it to life. The next thing I bought from H&M was this little <laughs> Miami Vice shirt, I guess, I don't know. It just kind of attracted me because of its shininess and I figured, you know, this would be a nice cute top to wear with some black bottoms, a little night out on the town, you know. But we'll see what I can come up with with it. It's, I wouldn't say it's out of my usual. I gotta make it work. I bought another bomber jacket, <laughs> so, I have really big plans for this one because it's plain black and it has nothing on it. So I already know what I want to do with it. I have a lot of like, I don't have them, but I'm going to buy them. I want to buy like a lot of decals that are personal to me. So I definitely want a big M somewhere and then I'll add little patches here and there on top of the felt. So all this is vegan leather. If you're one of those people who don't want to kill the animals, I'm here for it. So this was another cute one in the extra large. Besides the jackets and that, I just bought out a bunch of like accessories. I feel like I needed some gold jewelry and stuff. I don't really wear a lot of accessories. As you see, I always have the same chains and earrings. Very basic when it comes to accessories. But I'm really trying to step my accessory game up. So I bought some rings, earrings, a layered necklace that's cut on this. A layered necklace and then like a chunky necklace so those should be cute that's it for each then i went to bloomingdale's to return something but you know you can't go into bloomingdale's to return and not buy something else that's just like yeah so i saw these boots and they were calling my name these are from kurt geiger 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 am i saying that right um, kurt geiger and oh my god so much. Hold on. So yes, we instantly fell in love and I just knew that it had to go home with me. Now, I'm really big for the fall. I buy like one good boot. So this is going to be my one good boot because I have plenty of other boots, but like I'll add one more to the collection for fall and winter. And these are super cute. So many looks. Yeah, I'm gonna give them all to you, don't you worry. Because they're black, like let's be real, you can do anything with these. And this is, oh, I love this. Let's, let's zoom in a little bit more. How cute is that? Yes, come through. So, I don't know, I've been seeing a lot of this Kurt Gear brand. I bought that green bag that I had all the way my Instagram posts the other day. But, yeah, his stuff is actually pretty cute. And it, he kind of reminds me of Sam Edelman now that I think about it. They're kind of all around the same price point. Maybe this is a little bit more expensive than Sam Edelman, but it's that same look. So yeah. On my way out of Bloomingdale's, I saw this camera bag 
that I wanted last year and I didn't get it because it was late in the season and I felt like I wouldn't get no wear out of it. But here it is. Ooh. Now this, this is going, this is going to do it. Now, if you know Marc Jacobs, you've been seeing these little camera bags everywhere. What I love about them and what I love about any crossbody bag is you can change the straps. So he does sell a whole bunch of different straps separately. This is the one it came with, but I'm sure I could find other ones. But I actually like this black one. I feel like it kind of goes with the look, the little teddy bear look, and I love this. I want, the vision I have for this is I would like, <coughs> I would like like a fully cream outfit with some fuzzy shoes. Like that's that's the idea I have in my head. If I'm gonna find it, I don't know. Maybe not cream, more like that winter white. You know what I mean? Like that winter white. I don't know. But yes, this was definitely coming home with me. Like I needed this. Because I needed it last year and I didn't get it. So this year. This year was the year. The last place I stopped at was Zara. Now, to be honest with you, I'm not a big Zara shopper. One, because, you know, not a lot of things can fit me in there. And two, because their lines is always hella long. Like, who has time? Who has the time? They literally be having like eight, ten registers in the store and be having one open. Make it make sense, Zara. Make it make sense. But anyway, I stopped at Zara and the first thing that caught my eye was a bomber jacket. <laughs> like, duh, I'm gonna do like a bomber jacket haul. This is actually a men's jacket in a size extra large. I don't even think it buttoned, to be honest with you. I'm not gonna lie, I don't think it buttoned, but you know, we don't need it to button. I can make it look good without putting a button. That's cool. But how cute is this? Oh my God. This is one of those moments where I really wish I had a boyfriend because he would be looking fly. Like I would, I have to say, I would damn sure make sure my man was looking like fine. But you know, of course, he would also know how to dress too. Hopefully. But anyway, this is a men's jacket, and I love it. I love the green. Again, I have look planned for this. I just gotta find the rest of the pieces. So something I picked up on the way out from Zara. I didn't try it on, but it looks like it'll fit. It's this little like sweatshirt crop top. So I want to find some sweatpants that are this color and that's what's going to go with this and then find some nice green sneakers that will set the look off. That's the look I'm going for this. Or I could even spice it up with some heels. You know, we're going to see. We're going to see what I come up with. But again, I want to try things a little different. I don't want to necessarily show you guys just me trying them on. I want to give you a complete look sort of like a lookbook so I'm gonna try more so the try on hauls than like straight looks so once I complete these looks I'll put them back up and we will go through them together so really it'll be more so like what I bought this week that's where I'm headed to because I buy a lot of shit it's probably why I'm broke needless to say <laughs> so that's the end of what I bought from the mall today but I did want to do a quick little thing at the end so this is also an appreciation post to the people that have been with me from the beginning of my youtube journey thank you guys so much so i have hit a little bit over 500 subscribers and i honestly thought it was gonna be my mom and dad just watching these videos so i'm glad to know that you know there's people out there who find me somewhat somewhat interesting you know i definitely don't dive deep into my personal life but to be honest with you there ain't shit going on over here like i hope y'all don't feel like i'm keeping you out the loop there really ain't nothing happening i go to work i come home i go to work i buy clothes i come home that that's my life right now okay because i know when i first started the youtube channel it was um it was mostly about dating uh, essentially that's what i wanted to do when i first started the channel and then I was looking for an outfit for my birthday and then this is how all this happened. The dating content, although I love it and I do find it super interesting, if I'm being really real with you, like, who was dating? Like, I wasn't dating. It, it was real dry out there and I'm honestly at that point in my life where I'm okay with that because these have been shit. Sorry. These men ain't worth my time. Let's put it like that. Okay. 
I feel like my focus right now is going to be making sure I'm posting with you guys at least once a week, making sure I'm on my Instagram, like I'm supposed to be on my Instagram. Like I just be busy, like work be busy. I swear to God, I do not do it on purpose. I don't be like, I'm, I ain't finna post today. Like no, I really just be tired. I get off work and I'm like, I just wanna be my bed eating ice cream, not putting on a full face of makeup and I'm about to record that. But I find this super fun and relaxing because it's always like a whole thing for me to like get ready. I'll be like, oh, I gotta film, I gotta film. But then once I actually get into it, like I really enjoy doing it. And I definitely can see this being something long-term for me as long as I stick to it. Um, again, I just wanna thank you guys because I really feel like, and of course, to my friends and my family, my, my biggest supporter in the freaking world, my cousin Rochelle, like, if it wasn't for you guys, I would have been deleted this and said, fuck it, I'm done. <laughs> but the way you guys believed in me and feel like I can really do this makes me know, like, okay, like, maybe I really need to put my energy into this like I said I would. I said I would give it a year and, you know, it hasn't been a year yet, so... We're gonna keep it pushing. If you are new to my channel, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Honey, I'm coming at you. I'm coming at you with the content. I mean, I'm gonna try it out. <laughs> All right, thank you guys for watching. I will catch you at another time.